also got some mail. I'm sure it's not junk mail. I'm sure this is a very legitimate piece of mail that I received. This is junk mail. Oh my god, are you kidding? Oh my god, I should have known. You know what's you know what I hate is when you get junk mail from like companies you already do business with. Like I always, I always get junk mail from the same like insurance company I have about getting insurance from them. I'm like, are you kidding me? Is it from a Nigerian prince? Unfortunately, no. Unfortunately, no. Um. We can actually go in this one. Nothing. I guess this is close somehow. Where did she take us? Hmm. So I can't actually go in this one. Okay. This looks like a river. It's a river and birds. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. <clears throat> you snapped off an English... What? The hell? You know what I'm really surprised about this game though? It's like most horror games like this, it starts in like the late evening. Like early afternoon, like late afternoon, early evening, like right before the sun sets. It's still the same it's still like the same time of day almost. Okay, we could literally get there in like a half an hour. It's like just go, just walk. Don't don't get into any tanks to fall through the ground into the bottom. Just, just walk there, and we'll be fine. Don't do anything stupid. Don't go into any caves. It can't be far. Oh, little one, a village, people, a way home. Paris, you love Paris. We'll go walking in the Luxembourg Gardens. I'll show you where Alice used to play. Be okay, little one. Please be okay. I you know. How do I? How dare I have logic in a horror game? I mean, the smoke is literally right there. Come on. I wonder what, what? What? I mean, what could happen? Don't laugh at me. Shut up, bird. What's over when this we get way? To the village, you can meet the doctor. And Yasmin, uh, she's from Algiers. She's nice. And we'll figure out what's wrong with me. All will be well. All will be well. <sighs> Something's gonna happen. Okay, then go back around, go back around, go over to where the, the sand is, and then go that way. Oh my god. So what the hell is all this stuff? It 
it's like old stuff and like new like weird stuff mixed with like new stuff there's like a statue here oh no something's gonna happen why, why, why would you why I really don't like this why would you go why would you even go through here? That's my thoughts. That looks like a mystical butthole. It's fine. Check out my baby. Thank God that you are little one. I may not know where we are, but at least you're still with me. I'm so glad you're all right. What is this? Very alienish looking. Okay. They, they got oil here, so that's good, I guess. We got full lantern oil. Perfect. I like it. Oh no, I don't want to go in here. Are you kidding me? I don't want to. What the hell? What the hell? I don't want to go in here. Why would you go in there? Either the well was very deep, or she fell very slowly, for she had plenty of time as she went down to look about her, and to wonder what was going to happen next. I don't want to push it, I don't want to continue, I'm done. <laughs> I don't want to go in here! Every step we take it feels like we're further from them. There must be a way back. Well, this is okay. Um, what 
is that? I've seen that before somewhere. The woman from the oasis. Very weird. Oh, I can't. What the hell? Under the sign of Ranu on the fourth rise at the eighth calling, I, Atharu, make this record. As Tomeku directs, I have compared the most ancient of our records of the Empress's malady with the newly taken samples. In the earliest of samples, Tamaku was correct. The nutritive flow to both organs of general generativity were in, in, intact, albeit reduced, and therefore they would have been functional before the spinal repair. However, since the influx of, of vitae, the organs are now entirely withered. Why has the substance not reconstructed them? The degenerative malady effect malady affect them permanently before the treatment began. Malady. <laughs> I have asked whether I should prepare a report for the Empress, but Tamaku informs me that this is unnecessary. It is, of course, merely of alchemical interest and, and no matter for concern, for she is eternal in her name. So they're like an advanced species. I mean, doing some type of like spinal repair work or, or I don't know. Under the sign of Ranu on the third rise at the first calling, I rather you make this record. I have completed the comparison of the samples from the Empress and from the bones of her mother, blessed At Atua. It is clear now that both carried the sickness, although it did not manifest in the forebears. While Vitae is powerful enough to rebind bone and sinew without repeated application, the health again deteriorates. A single do dose is no cure and merely dries the decay back for a time. Tamaku orders that I test repeated application quantities insertion points timings insertion points tell me more in her name interesting so they're having some type of like this one's like not working some type of deterioration or something of their bodies I like how they have like these stone looking tablets, but they're like electronical or something. This is very weird. Elendor Septark of the Enkindled Fortress has dispatched messengers to the Outer Isles under the guise of a trade mission, despite our previous warning. It is my recommendation that we relocate three fists of the Second Regiment to the Isles immediately. On the matter of the harvested stock, it has been suggested that with the new chamber development, the need for such stock will diminish. I believe that I believe that is short-sighted. This new capacity surely means that we are at liberty to increase the number of factories. With that, we can vastly increase our defense cap capability as well as increase the standards of living across the Empire. This new expertise is a gift. We would be wise to make use of it. Instruct me, Great Empress, and I will inform the Council of your decision in your name eternal. I find myself again confined. A day should not matter. But each day feels like waste. There is so much to do. Tamaku tells me that now, with Vitae, I have forever. But the people who depend on me do not. There is always something 
Invasion, rivalry, sickness, penury. I have my duty. Perhaps I should end these sessions. Now they've found a way to stabilize the disease. I should be ecstatic. I should accept my fate and move on. It is such a faint hope that they can find any way to heal me. That they can find any way to grant my dearest wish. Now you are eternal, says Tamaku. Now you need no heir. None of them understand. This is not about politics or securing a future. This is not for the Empire. This is for me. Just for me. Okay. Yeah, let's see what the hell this thing does. Okay, weird key thing. Should I bring it with me? Nope. Nope! <laughs> that answers that! There's a weird freaking crap in this place. Another door. Stuff down there too. What, like, ho like, holy crap, like what the hell? Under the sign of Edu on the first rise at the eighth calling, I, Kita, make this record. The configuration of the new test gate has been delayed by a failure in a subsidiary node. Maharia, you must complete it on the next rise as you have been prepared. Place the orb in the center, select the focusing symbol for this alignment, and insert two full cells of Vitae. Remember Tamaku's lessons, Mahara. Master the orb. It is your focus and discipline that will open the portal and allow objects to be sent through. Okay, that's, yep, sure, that's fine. Now what is this thing? Oh, it's, there. it's, it's a door thing.
wonder if this will open this door. Nope. Oh no, it does do something. Oh, it does. Alive. Um, uh, um, <laughs> I don't know if I want to do anything with this. That's kind of creepy. of living flesh crawls from the hole in the world and turns all to ash and rust. The city falls. I am to blame. My companions took my formula, some to use it to destroy the Vitae at the gate, others to infect the Vitae pipelines and end the suffering. The gate has indeed fallen, but catastrophically, unleashing energies beyond belief. Still the factories scream. We have failed, in the worst of ways. It is my duty to stay at my post, to see if I can find means to end it. I have no choice but to use the Vitae. An ocean holds the great empress to life, so a meager portion will suffice for me. If any find this record, know that I was the traitor Kita, alchemist. Apprentice to Tamaku. Forgive us our folly. Um. Okay. Like a lore dump. Tamaku's early experiments with the orbs summoned an entity, a creature, that scarred the world with its passing and wreaked utter destruction. The scar took the form of living, pulsating flesh. I have studied the orb, and I now know why the scars appear. I believe I can make use of the same perturbation to achieve our own ends. Perturbation? This is a word you don't hear every day. I guess they were studying that stuff. It has taken me many, many rises in the gaps between my work for Tamaku, but finally it is done. I have a formula which is in sympathy with the pulse of the orb. I can provoke the symptoms of the red flesh, and with it will come destruction, channeled through the Vitae network. This might be the answer we seek. So what is the Vitae network? 
So I can do that. That must be what this person is plugged into. I don't know if I want to do anything with that yet. This is pretty cool looking and very frightening. Now let's go back in here. Got some lantern oil, which is awesome. A large, a large flask too. Perfect. So what the hell is this? So try to match that. The first one's right. And the last no last one is right. It's the middle one is wrong. either. <laughs> you I'm don't know you're what's here, happening. Though. Look at this place. It isn't Arabic or Tuareg or Ottoman or anything I recognize. Mm. Looks French. Well, we're gonna put the orb on here, I think, don't we? that work? I'm locked in here now. So now I, now I think I have the orb at the right combination. Now I think I gotta take it and put it on that pedestal maybe? What about, I don't know, I don't know what's going on here though. Let's go, let's go further down the hallway. Bring that thing with me, though. Stuff makes. I don't like it. That should. No? Hmm. Maybe we do have to do something here now. 
I feel like if I disconnect this guy, something bad's gonna happen. Or... Kills him. Jar a container brimming with etheric fluid. Got one jar. So creepy. Got one jar. Oh, I have to put it in here, don't I? I need to, oh, I get it. I get it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Sorry, dude. Um, I kind of want to leave this place, so I, 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 I apologize. Um, yeah. Sorry. What you gotta do, I guess. Rudeness. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't really have a choice. It over there. So they were testing like teleportation. to do. Guys. 
I am a puzzle master. Okay, that that scar stuff was uh, What's happening? Eleven. Alice? Alice can't play. Alice can't play. Alice is gone. Don't worry, Mama. I'm here. That is not human.
There's no way. Oh, great. This is gonna suck. <sighs> well, guys, thanks for watching. I think we're done <laughs> for today. Um, this was pretty good. They took a lot of things in the original animation, I think, and, like, expanded. I have no idea what's happening, though, with the story. Like, at all yet. Um, but it's, it's pretty good so far. It's got some pretty good spoops. It's got some pretty good spoops. Um, definitely play this again tomorrow. I don't know how long this game is. Um, uh, but I'm, I'm enjoying it quite a bit.